see what they can produce on this. Looking at Sick. The wall's up now, and they can't really make an entry towards that top side. Spike has been planted, and it's a fury to get back in here. Shazam with one on the ghost to Durka. And that's a quick drop. Shazam on the jet for this game. If we haven't already noticed, he's going to be the one making the plays. They're getting the defuse down. Shazam's going to find it. They cut the wire and they get the first round over on Sentinel. Viper Utility down on the ground. And they've gone for that kind of partial buy here. Coming into the second round, the spike plant and extra money. Makes them feel good about putting a little bit of investment here into this second round. Toxic screens start to go up as Boaster gains a little bit of ground. He does not have a shock dart for another three, but he gets into position to fire that off here as Durka takes another one down. Dapper falls. Yeah, forced to push in his Sentinels. They know they have to make the action happen here. If they allow everybody to fall back off of the spike into those post plant positions. It's going to be very tough indeed, and that's what's beginning to happen here. Fnatic with good positioning overall. Bosa playing around yellow can sense the presence here of Sentinels as they start to make the move forwards. Bosa is able to at least deal with one. Two more players here for Sentinels as they get the pressure on. But Zoms, he's going to have to try to stick this and he's going to be burning in the acid. Oh. Not a great look for him. For now, sight take if you're Sentinels with so little in the way of equipment. We do have the knives out from Shazam. He's able to nail Durka around the side. He goes, Shazam oh. is annihilating everybody with the ultimate and that's going to cause a lot of problems here two players left doma and magnum as they try to swing their way around the pressure's coming in though the spike gets tapped and forced to fight is magnum and he will not be able to deal with the numbers sentinels lock it in thanks to shazam's heroics oh my already this game is so big because we see it's already a rec recuperation buy with still some specters they it was one for one as we went into round two which means it was an eco sentinels was building back up and the op investment after that back and forth economy it, it needs to at least return something so great job by fanatic to start off there make it really sting on this round to start and it's going to be sentinels to pick this up and find that off if they can doma says not this time though yeah, great moves going up on the wall in the toxic, and rather in the poison orb. That's so smart. Really creates problems here. There's not much left now for, sen uh, for Sentinels, leaving just sick after Zombs goes down. And Fnatic, you know, you, you said it's going to be very back and forth, and it's yep. looking like Fnatic have such a strong response. Shazam, after having such a great round just previous, struggling to connect that one shot, and that was all it took. That opportunity going to Fnatic, they knew how to play out that man advantage. And again, it's that methodical approach towards that B-side that's been causing some issues. Yeah. So that's actually had massive value. Util to come up. Shock Dart come in from six. Shazam goes down, though, as they're still waiting for a little bit of fine to get back into this site. Maybe a sonar bolt to make it happen. 4v4 on the retake as Durka takes aim from all the way on the back of steps. Boast a great so well line on up. that Hunter's Fury, absolutely. And also he has the ability to go for this late lurk, this flank. It has been detected. Dapper's looking for it on the back. He's actually going to take down Boaster, and there goes the spike tap. It's going to be Fnatic having to force the issue. Moving closer now. They've got to close the distance because the stick seemed to be coming, but Tense comes off of it to get the frag to prevent the trade. <gasps> has to stick it again. Does he have time? Can he make it work? Oh! oh! Fnatic able to take that one. My goodness, that was so very close. Boaster got so much good vision in mid. He droned all the way under two into a kitchen, seeing Viper both of Zoms and I believe Sick back there. So they have a great idea of what kind of utility they'll be facing after seeing the slow orbs. Fnatic is doing a great job of just getting in the mind of Sentinels here before these rounds start, which is why it looks like they're moving so seamlessly into B each time. And a nice Viper bite to get a frag there onto Dapper. Oh my god, all the Viper is coming through here and it's just an absolute mess, but there's no one on the spike just yet. You can see some oh, not quick enough to deal with the second Nano Swarm. Got the first one though. Sick able to take down Magna, makes it a 3v3, but time is against Sentinels on this retake. Bosa's trying to push the issue, find his way forward towards the spike. He's dealt with the issue there, and Ooh. that will be Fnatic picking it up. He's coming. Having utility come back every 30 or so seconds for controllers and whatnot. But it looks like that's when they want to execute. So they're going to plant shortly after this unless they're drawing things out of uh, Sentinels on this. Or Fnatic, sorry. And actually going through towards A, actually. Ooh. Oh, that's a good early defense coming through from Tens. And Shazam knocking down everybody here for Fnatic. Very little left to work with. Boaster left. and Durka is all that remain. And time is against them here as yeah. well. Shazam, he doesn't stop. Another one for him. That's all Durka can do to maybe get a couple kills there. Keep some damage. 
there, but Shazam finishes it off with style. Lovely stuff. We know that. It's one of the things the operator does best is it shuts down aggression. What a shot coming in there from Shazam. Tens answers as well as they start to take a few at a little bit of an econ buy here as they farm down Fnatic for round eight. Oh here, Riv, and soon the game will be given away for Fnatic with this plant on B. Look, the size of B always allows it a sight that 5v5 are alive once the spike goes down. Here we are for that play. Spam just through the underside of the box where Zoms can cut it. The heal, or rather, Rez comes in down to Shazam now. And they are cleaning up a bit at the site as the trades go back and forth, Dan. Yeah, lovely stuff. Fnatic running out of time, though, unfortunately for them. So that just messes with the timings here for Fnatic. They're going to be forced to make their way forward, though. Magnum, with a great creep forward, takes down Zoms. Dapper might be in with a chance here as he wants to try to harass them. But now, down to three players. Dapper has to survive. He's got to keep his team anchored on this site for a retake. I love the way they altered the strat a little bit from the side of Fnatic. Usually that wall is up when they get into the site. This time it's down and they say, how much room will you give us, Sentinels? It was quite a bit of room, but here comes Shazam once again. We've seen it before. Another one, but he's over at yellow. That's Mystic. That's the round. Timeline, it is going to be another purchase Ooh. here. <laughs> Sentinels do go down, but Shazam puts an extra 200 bucks in his pocket as they aggress. You know, it was Fnatic taking a bit of ground. Now Sentinels is saying, we'll take that ground first and do quick pepper shots as Durka drops it. Shazam goes down. Yeah, that first pick was totally gross. Now it's up to Tens to hold this one down. He's not sick as well. Sick is going to get taken out by Durka, and Tens is going to go forward. He doesn't really have much choice. So with that said, after the dust settles, there's only two players remaining now for Sentinels in this retake. But only three to deal with, so it feels quite doable for them. This Dapper presses his way forward, but the Viper's pit coming through is certainly going to make life more difficult here for Sentinels. Som's up above trying to find his way forward. But Ooh, got... last round. Bring Fnatic a little closer to these angles. That's going to be one frag. Shazam probably knows there's more behind that jump as they're looking to rotate to either site. But he may have to move now that he got found out. 30 seconds left. Yeah, huge pick and... It almost seemed like they tried to punish the, the fact that he was there as opposed to A, and then they walk into 10s. So, only three players Durka. left. Fnatic, as they make their way into that B site now. And there's not much time left here. Durka, nice opening pick following it up as well, but it's optimistic now. 10 seconds to plant this spike. He might just be able to get this down, but he's got Shazam in there. Just Ooh. such a presence on that B site. And there's a swing. Gets the dink, but 10s has the ghost advantage. And there goes the spike down. Sentinels in great advantage now. They've got the clock playing against Fnatic as well as the post plant positioning and an extra player as well. So looking very nice so far from Sentinels. Looking for Dapper. 30 second heal for him. Abilities coming back up. Sick. Looking to take some shots from the right. His 10's now firing forward and finds one in two. Boaster on the flank now. This could actually be huge as he's turned around on by Zombs. Who's going to win that fight? The timing. Both are doing some damage there. It's up to Mystic now to try to do this. There's two players to worry about. Oh my goodness, Mystic Whoa. somehow makes that one work. Perfect timing. He's got Does it. he have enough though? Does he have enough time for this deep fuse? It's close. Oh, oh not quite. Point Mystic. Zero, Such a good. I mean, if they just went to hit A there, the push is pretty intense coming in from that side of Fnatic. There's shots come in to start the round as they trade one for one. Here comes the play for, more forward in towards this A site now. Fnatic have to try to defend this. Don't think they want to play retake. Bosa in a forward position will get taken down. Nice trade though from Durka. Has that Vandal to work with. And Fnatic have this back site control mostly still to play with. So that's a good omen for them. But Zoms is up close and personal inspector to running out of bullets though. And the trades keep on coming through. Fnatic still with a chance here. But Tens is making it impossible. Fantastic finish from him. And that said, I, I did really enjoy Mystic players here. Once again, that B long presence is maintained by Fnatic. They really want to win this. Durka actually going forward, gets the Ding Doma finishing off 10s. Rez comes through though, and Sentinel's getting a lot of action towards this B long position once again. And I mean, maybe even asking questions through the tube. Mystic has to try to respond in mid here. They've got to get something back, but it's just failing here, Riv. There doesn't seem to be any anything for them. Already got their way in. 
Here come the abilities, utilities out. Dapper with a great kill on Dederka. And now Mystic's gonna do what he can. He's been fantastic in these situations, but alone now, he tempers himself to not, or make sure rather, he does not go down. Here comes the retake from both sides. Still a little bit tentative on the side of Fnatic as they watch their flanks, and it looks like they may allow this round to go through. <laughs> oh, Mystic! Threading the needle there with that Spectre. Light in the fuse. This is getting quite awkward now. 3v3. Soms is fine for pit is out of the picture, but Mystic has his... Oh, oh no. Oh, oh my god. Magnum with the oh timing. Oh my god. Oh, that's a spike too. You hate to see it. Perfect Not play for Magnum. One enemy remaining. I have this this no round defense. is something else right now, Dan. <laughs> There's no time here really for tens, is there? And that Viper's Pit is so much to work against. But maybe you can get a frag out of it, at least. That's, what, that's, that's the goal, at least. Nope, and there it is. It's a Hunter's Fury will come first to hold the lockdown if it really becomes necessary with the spike play. And Zombs will fall. Eagle Eye Boaster comes up big. Huge pick off to get. Oh, Mystic goes in as well, finds Shazam, and there is a huge opening here now for Fnatic. But speaking of which, Tens is going forward. The trade comes through, though. Then Fnatic Whoa. are holding on wonderfully. That's such a great hold from them. Couldn't have gone back now, and they, they know right. that. So Sentinels, it's not ideal for them, but they can still make this one work. It's very, very sketchy. Oh, a couple kills coming through for Fnatic through all of the smokes that are down, and just it's no man's land. It's... Very difficult to get across to a planting position here for Sentinels. They're really working against it, and it only gets worse. The knives come out from Shazam with 33 health left. He gets, <laughs> she gets hit through the toxic screen, no less. That's not a good look for Sentinels. Sums takes down one, but there's, there's too much to deal with. Fnatic looking very... You know, we, we see the killjoy here for Fnatic, Ooh. not for Sentinels. They don't even have the Cypher over there, so... It's been difficult if they have not taken an area. A lot of frags to come out here to start with a res and Magnum! Fire and down the sights, able to take out two. Huge kills, big fight around middle here from both teams. And it looks like Fnatic are coming out ahead. Two versus three for Sentinels. Up tube goes Zoms perhaps, trying to dodge the drone. And Sick needs to make some plays as well. He's crept his way through that B site. Oh, he's been spotted by the turret. Feels bad. Now he just has to hit the shots. And it's sick after all. That's a fantastic shot onto Magnum. Leaving it up to Zoms with a minute to play with. He's got the spike. He's going to make his way towards this A site. And there is a real chance here for Zoms. He knows that his opponents will not be anywhere near this A site. He knows he'll have quite a bit of space to maneuver here in this post plant. But it's going to be a tough one. No util left. Poison orb out. He's, that's going to pop. And he'll be able to play that a little bit now. One peek. Oh, just gets the ADS in. Back to thing. There's been no precedent set by Fnatic that they're going to be doing that. So varying it up, Fnatic is really starting to put things into the mix here to make sure Sentinels has to think twice. And Mystic again pushes up. One enemy remaining. Not much left in the tank here now for Sentinels. Shazam against four players. And looking for that initial damage. Nice shot onto Boaster. But there's much more to be done. And they know exactly where he is now. There's... No more element of surprise to work off of. Shazam starts to work his way around, and all his opponents have to do is stick together and not give him any opportunities. There's a turret laid down, Shazam. He knows he can't do too much here. He's going to be able to get this spike planted for the extra money at least. <laughs> here they come. Oh, oh dear. Dashing <gasps> out. That almost looks like the tube, but Tensor's gone up into kitchen. This could be, this is this is the X factor in this round. We'll see what Durka can do holding on to Yellow in the Ice Orb, but he's able to get himself the kill, and he's still sticking around with the Cloud Burst with the Knives out. It's definitely a dangerous prospect for Sentinels, Ooh. but they'll deal with him eventually. Dapper takes down Durka, head in the clouds for the moment, as Tenz gets Magnum. It looks like Sentinels put themselves in a good spot for the, this round accordingly. And that's going to be the Viper's Pit going down. Dapper's in it. He'll plant. And let's see how this post plan is set up with Mystic getting a frag as the Hunter's Fury comes across as well. Just coordinating things here, getting the res. A brief period of calm as they set up the retake. Fnatic. Very scary stuff. And there goes the Hunter's Fury. That's going to be very problematic here for 
Fnatic can see Shazam able to take down Bosa. Wrapping around, Domo's able to find one. The trade comes through. Magnum taps the spike, forces out some util out the Viper's pit. He perfectly oh baited sick there. Oh my God. Almost gets the next one as well. And that is oh. it. Can he find the time? No, not quite. Didn't get it up to halfway. It was a great attempt. And oh my word, it's so hard to run in that deep snow. There was no way he was getting away. Uh, wow. Ever. Let's get tapped by the drone, falls back, actually survives. Dirk will slow things down as well, and that will buy some time for the rotation, but maybe not. Zoms is straight through, takes down Durka, and Sentinel's off to a good start to try to clinch this one. This mid oh. control coming from Sentinels as well, but a nice shot from Domo will cut that in half. It's now just going to be Shazam lurking up there. Bladestorm ready for him. Making his way forward to see what he can get done here. Oh, well, not too word. much. <laughs> Shazam. Dapper will be taking down the wall. They're going to be pretty cautious here in how they're trying to make the attack. Durka up close and personal with that frenzy, trying to deal with Sick. Oh, great bounce comes through from Shazam. The shocked up will do the damage needed as now Backsight is under contestation as Sentinel's looking to win that control at the back and they're going to win every frag as well. So that is what you want to see if you are a Sentinel's fan. It's something that is quite Fnatic squad, you know, spreading out a little bit. A lot of presence towards Garage and C Long looking actually like they want to go just for a straight C split here. Dirk actually takes down Dapper at the back of C. That's a huge win. It's up to Zoms to do the damage now. With the Spectre, he's going to get absolutely nothing. And Fnatic, they've absolutely crippled Sentinels early on in this round. Love the Guiding Light coming through there. The fake on quite a few of them. And the buy again. Fully but surely. At the same time, Sentinels are starting to feel some of that pressure towards C and Garage once again. It's been a favorite here for Fnatic. They are really trying to condition Sentinels to expect this. Nice flash around the side from Sick. Another one coming through, perhaps. They're trying to slow, slow things down. Seekers making their way through as well. Desperately trying to hold on to back sight. It's a huge position for Sentinels to keep hold of to make sure oh, that they win word. this round. <laughs> They're sure in the same spot. Who's going to pay rent, Dan? That's the question. It's coming up now. Shazam with a few shots, and they start to trade. Really forced to take the fights here at this point. There's players all over the place. Doma able to take down Zoms. And Tens comes in from the flank now. This could be the play to end things. Fantastic control from him. Takes down Mystic. And it's too easy for Dapper to take down the retreating. I wonder when B would come into the mix. Mystic goes down. Hunter's Fury comes across. And they're going to look to plan again. Dirk now focused on that as the rest of the team is focused on the angles. And a nice hold from Magnum. He's in mid. They're kind of trying to organize how they want to play this. Because two members of uh, Sentinels are on each side of B. Yeah, the A-Link, C-Link split through to the sites. Fnatic playing quite a few players on, on the sites. This actually might be quite helpful for Fnatic's chances to hold this. It comes the first Ooh. swing. There's no trade, though, at all. Set, well, eventually Tens will find it. In fact, he gets Boaster as well up on top of the structure. We'll see what else Tens can find here as he looms above. Ever dangerous. Doma takes down absolutely everybody except Tens. Can he find him? No. Tens from above. Able to take down Doma, the last player standing. And that's the defuse in. Well, I'll for quick hits as it comes into A here. They're going to be in pretty precarious positions on the side of Sentinels as this A hit comes in. That's going to be the peak from Tens, though. And this looks like it'll be a committal, Dan. You want to fight it. Yeah, they have that lockdown left. coming through as well. And Zoms is going to try to get the kill. Nice snap from Zoms. He might be able to get out of there in time as well. You can see the pursuit is in, but indeed, Zoms has made it to safety. That's a beautiful play from him. And that will oh, give Sentinels the advantage. There goes the Cosmic Divide. Dapper straight through the window. No fear from him. Leaving Boaster on the flank. And they know where Boaster is. All out the Hound. And Sentinels, they're in position to hold back sight again. Again, this is such a crucial position to hold. Six up on yep. the platform. Fantastic work from Sentinels. They are dropping Fnatic members with ease at this point. Only two remaining at this moment. The Seekers will go out. Boaster on the flank, yep. but tens with the daggers is lethal. Things down a lot. Right now, Fnatic have to go fast, but the utility is, is really holding them at bay. And the rotation is going to come through. The dash from Dirk is in, but he gets taken down again. Reinforcements is already here. The cavalry have arrived. Wow. And it wasn't even necessary. Great hold coming through from Sentinel. Utility, but just falling off immediately. And it looks like we might actually have Sick pushing a short here. So difference there. And Tens up on the structure. Dirk is going to walk straight into his crosshairs. 
And the C split once again seems to be the order of the day here for Fnatic. Down a man, but if they're able to get in against Dapper, they might be in for some good times. Dapper gets concussed. He's in trouble. There comes the Cloudburst to keep him out, away from harm's way just for the moment. But Fnatic seem to win every battle. And they have the sight. player standing. What a much needed round and the way they're performing it as well. Happening beautifully, only losing to Killjoy Sound. And now they're like, wait, nothing's happening yet. What a strat from Fnatic. Completely routing Sentinels, but Sentinels as well feel like they are a retake team. We know this, we see this, and still feel back. comfortable in this situation. Let's see how both teams play it with five up. Spike planted. And back them all. Oh, can't oh, take down Zombs. That's the, a big problem. Mystic on the site. It's got a lot to do. Able to take down Tens from up high, but there's so many players. The flash comes through. Nowhere to work off. In the corner. Burning Ooh. in the hot hands. Mystic still alive somehow. Doma keeps him alive for a moment longer. Into a two versus two here. Fnatic, they pick up the res. Doma is doing more with Mystic. Oh Ooh. my god, Fnatic. That's so. All day check for this. Get a lot of aggression in the mid position as well. Oh. He's able to pick himself up. A kill on the weapon. Storm's backside on B. Still causing problems. Spamming through the Astra smoke. Is able to take down at least one. In comes the Hunter's Fury as well to add insult to injury. From the hands of Shazam as Mystic goes up close. Wants to get the punish. Oh, that's the jump right click from Tens to deal with Mystic. Away. Ooh, great timing from Boaster. Takes down Sick. Huge opportunity because right now Fnatic are not committed one way or the other. They have a minute to play with. Deep position from Bosa. We'll see what he can do as he's against Dapper. <gasps> the spray through is good for Dapper. That's going to even things up. Four versus four. And looks like Fnatic, they are going to commit onto this A site. Yeah, I was going to say, it's rare you see Garage play. There has to be a play off the ball here. It's the A play for Fnatic. One minute left in the round. Cosmic Divide comes up. And we're going to see how it's going to be worked here. Up over. Doma wants to get a little five-head play going up, so they got different angles they're entering the site at, and it only works for a few. Sentinels will find that one. They seem impenetrable at this out of tens as he was pushing forward on defense. Now it could be even more effective on offense, but Fnatic wants to start off strong. Magnum with the frenzy to get that first frag on the board. Dirk is on the chase here in window. There goes the, the flash from Sky to give him a, an assist. Dapper is able to escape though, and Bosa's coming for him as well. Dapper is just so slippery at the moment. He's got four players on him at the moment. <laughs> so he's eventually going to go down. And in the meantime, his teammates, all three of them, have made their way through B into the A site for A plants. It's going to be a difficult hold against five players, but they at least do have the opportunity to do so. And they're going to hear the thunder footing of the entire Fnatic roster coming up the A long and A short positions. Oh, this is going to be a tough hold. Zoms has that frenzy. There we go. Picks up one. A second one coming through from Zoms, and that might make the difference. 2v2 now. Shazam picks up another. It's up to Zoms to finish it off. He's got 22 health. He is extremely weak. Mystic has to try to bait him out, but Zoms is not falling for it. He is not going to call this at all. He's going to just force the stick. Such a great play from Zoms. Now just jiggling, oh, but maybe, has he done enough? Beautiful. He hasn't done enough. Mystic, beautiful indeed. <laughs> This is so absurd to see actually on a B take. Everybody on the outside, they're leaving it to the last moment. So the utility used has to be super impactful. Running in, Durka gets tens, and that's going to be the start. Oh, this is a problem for Sentinels right now. The defuse is coming through. The stick is coming through. It's almost there. Oh, my God. The spray is going to do it. And it's... Oh, no. It's basically a mausoleum on the site there. It's all the bodies in one place. Gary that could be walking straight into Durka here with those nice. Oh, guess one! Tens is down. Durka, another one coming through the updraft, looking to find additional damage out of those knives. He might just do it. Out comes the Marshal. But he's done enough. He has done enough for... 30 seconds left. And here comes Magnum to make matters worse. Ooh. Lovely stuff. You can see the gravity well completely destroyed every knives. There goes the updraft as he tries to get the entries. The right click Ooh. misses from Tens and Fnatic are defending this one. Uh-oh, this is a problem. That's the spike now down on the ground on the long ramp. And Fnatic are just pulling Sentinels apart piece by piece for to get. Bosa would be such an issue 
on the retake, but now he's out of the equation entirely, thanks to Sick. And they can get that spike planted, and that is exactly what they're going to do. An, an open plant. Not much util remaining, though, for Sentinels. That might be an advantage here. Cosmic Divide does come through. There's a res as well used by Fnatic to get Boaster back in. Oh, this is going to be Dapper tough. Here. Dapper with a big flank back. as they start this, Dan. Side entry starting. And we'll see what he's able to do. His timing might be a little bit off here. He's quite far back at this point. The spike is already being diffused here by Fnatic. Tens able to find the headshot onto Durka. The pressure is coming through, though, still. A problem that spike keeps getting restarted on the defuse. Doma has to oh. stick it for Tens. Nails Doma with that Marshall at distance. Great round from Sentinels. Oh. Into the action here, Riv. Dan, I'm not sure how something that just came across my mind, but remind me to remind me in just a second as we get right. this round. Uh, <laughs> Sam starting off there big, and it looks like that is going to cause a pause for Fnatic here as they slowly play this. Durka loves short. He loves short A. This is his vibe spot, and it's going to be a one. It's going to be a two for Durka as he gets out. Yeah, fantastic pickup. That's, that's a spot that you can sometimes get massive value from. What a time to get it. Fnatic now might be finding their way onto the site just in the right moment. Bosa back site. Does he know someone's already ahead? Oh my god, the knives flying past Bosa. Takes down Zoms. And there's Magnum for the assist. And looks like that's a wrap. This could be a good time for the mental note uh, for you, Riv, to uh, remind yourself to remind yourself. It actually is because we're looking at Shazam. The mental note is about the Sova. Uh, as, as Shazam plays this out, let's talk about what happened in the previous half when Fnatic... Okay, Shazam goes down. Fnatic was planning aggressively on sites. They All of this. And he could try to do that, and that's... All right, they're going to go with it. Straight in, goes sick with the running back. The dash comes through as well. As Sense comes out, but he goes down. Zoms with the trade onto Durka and Bosa. There's still players here for Fnatic causing problems on the site. There's so much work to be done here from Sentinels, and it looks like they may have done everything they need to at least get some somewhere safe to plant this spike, but Ooh. maybe no. There's no respite for Sentinels because Fnatic just don't stop the aggression. Oh, no. Sentinel it is a game of timing. Just holding position in window for the moment. Oh, Hunter's Fury absolutely nailing Doma in the A site. And that might be the opportunity now for Durka to get his flank on. But will he get there in time? Mystic, with a nice hold, gets traded through. But still, it's about this flank from Durka. Can he activate this one? The knives are out. Sick doesn't know about it. There's the first kill. Able to dash away. Dapper can't plant the spike. And in oh, from the it. back again. Durka comes through. Opens it up for Magnum to lock it in. Leaps himself up. He'll be quite strong. So this is the get out. Play retake all over again. These strats have been so zany. I love what Fnatic just did there. Trying to make a Sentinels play sweaty. Sentinels then, really, you can see him rethinking how to play position. It looks like we're reset here for both sides. And Fnatic, the better off in this situation. Yeah, they've also suggested that there could be a flank. But they're all combining their forces here. In the front, in the window, through spawn. Tens has a lot of work on his hands here. He's not going to be able to deal any damage. It's up to Dapper there. Oh, Whoa. no! What in? What Whoa. in? What the hell was that from Dapper? And he just nails it. Seeing that here from both teams, Sentinels versus Fnatic, a possible final round in this best of three. Absolutely, my jaw is still just... <laughs> I mean, seeing that, Sentinels should be able to read that there are more there. Usually a jumper means they are guarded by someone else, so little tidbits of information they could use. Trailblazer comes out. Oh, one side's not watched, though. Traded. It's a huge dash from Tens, but still alive here. For Bosa and Magnum, for Fnatic to keep their chances alive and prevent themselves going down to the lower bracket. Lots of work to be done, but it's a quick rotation from Sentinels towards this C site. You can see that very aggressive cosmic divide there. Locking away spawn. Oh, Bosa's managed to pick himself up an upgrade, but this is just so difficult. Is Magnum going to make a solo play through this smoke? He has to wait. They have to draw fake, fake control oh! here. Oh, he doesn't. They come in, so Bosa just says, go off my plays. Go off these orbs. We have to be able to hit them and figure out where some are. So now Bosa gets that sentry information to where the players of Sentinels could be. I know exactly where. And there it is. Dapper's going to lock it in. Sentinels have bested.